Hey YouTube, I'm back with an actual unboxing video today. So um, I wanted to show you guys what I got in here. And um, I got a Tamagotchi Ocean, um, the, the Japanese version of course, because the American versions are like super duper expensive. Um, but I wanted to show you this one first and this is the other ocean that I have. So this is my second one that came today. And this one uh, is the red version, obviously has a uh, white detail around the screen and yellow buttons. Um, and I got this one a while back, oh, several years ago, probably like five years ago, maybe four years ago. It's been a while. And I got it because it was only like 30 bucks at the time. And I got it because it was an ocean. I was like, well, you know, I really want one. So I didn't care at the time. So I got this one, but secretly though, like, <laughs> I've wanted one of the ones that look like actual ocean or water or whatever. And I found one on eBay for, I think the starting bid was, I was 50 something. I ended up paying 69 with shipping, $10 with shipping. So it was, I think it was, ended up just being 59, but with the $10, it was 69. So this is not a bad deal. And I ended up with getting the... And I already opened the box. But I have not really looked at this yet. But apparently it's like a really, really awesome, like amazing condition. I got this blue one. And let me try to focus. It's got, I'm going to take it out of the package and start it up. It even came with the original pull tab. Um, I'm hoping it comes with the directions. I'm not sure if it does. The package doesn't look bad. It feels a little dusty, but that's okay. Um, it has, it is, it is used, but it is in very, very, very good condition. So this is, the tape has been peeled, obviously. There's really not that many like bends or rips. I mean, it, it is an older package, obviously. You can see that, but let's see. I'm anxious to see if it comes with, oh, it does. I, you know, I don't know if I've ever done an unboxing video or a walkthrough video on the ocean, but we're going to do that today. And I'm really, really excited. Oh, look. <laughs> that's funny. I've never noticed that. That's behind, that's behind the, the Tama. That's funny. That little evil looking fish. <laughs> um, anyway. Okay. So I don't know if I've ever walked, done a walkthrough video or anything on the ocean, <laughs> the ocean is really cool because it's it's definitely different, but I think it um it is a very unique virtual pet or Tama, but um at the same time it is the hardest one in my opinion to raise and completely take care of because it's very hard for me to um to make it by past like four days without it dying. Um, you have to devote all of your attention to it. So this is going to be the only Tama that I'm running right now. I had my For You, but I put it on pause because I'm going to need all my attention for this one. And I've always wanted this little whale character. Oh, the main character, whatever. But I, I've ended up with the clam before. And I think that's like the average character. Um, I've ended up with the clam and I've ended up with, there's another one that I got, but I don't remember, but it wasn't a good one. It was like one of the low characters. Um, and I guess that shows, wow, that shows what happened when it happens when it dies. Um, but these, yeah, these are the original directions. Very nice. Shows you how to put the batteries in. Those are the only words on and off that I can read on this video, which is great on any of this directions and 1998 made in China. Um, so yeah, I like these directions there. They look very oceany. That's even a word. Um, I do like the characters on these Tamas. Uh, they're really cute and I like ocean things. The, uh, the American ones, I cannot even believe they're like that expensive. That is ridiculous. I have no idea why. And I remember, oh my gosh, I remember being young. Okay. I remember this and we went to Walmart Tama's, the original Tamagotchis have been out for probably like a year or something like that. And um, I remember going to Walmart and seeing like an end cap on a shelf with the angels. And I do remember seeing the oceans. I remember that. I remember seeing that and telling my mom, oh my gosh, I want that. And she's like, no. So, but I remember that. 
I remember the oceans and I could have had one and I could have had one and it could have been worth a lot of money now and I just don't and pfft, whatever. Anyway, but I don't think this has batteries, but I have, um, no, no, it doesn't. I can feel it from the pull tab. It does not have batteries, so I'm going to take out um, the screws and put new batteries in because I want to start it up so I can do the the walkthrough with you. Oh, gosh, it's going to take like five minutes to hatch. I am so sorry, y'all. Oh, wow, look at the screws. They're like really good. Those are nice. And the sticker's nice, Bandai 1997, made in China. That is in such good condition. And there's like no scratches anywhere on this shell. That is wild. I got a good deal. I think so. So, yeah, that's the original pull tab. Let me see. The screws aren't that tight in there. Wow, these come out really nice and they're shiny. <gasps> these are really shiny screws. They're in very good condition. Apparently everything works good, sound and pixels. That's what I read on the listing, so we are gonna find out. <gasps> it does, I like that noise. So, in your opinion, Comment down below, please. What do you think about the ocean if you've played with one? I think they are pretty hard to take care of. They, I think, in my opinion, are the hardest Tama to raise and completely take care of. Um, go ahead and comment down below if you'd like. Because I really want to hear what you have to say. <laughs> Whatever you think is the... Oh, I love it! Look at the bubbles! I always love that. And then this fish. Okay, come on. All right. Set the time. I don't even know what time it is. This, this is 9.07. But we're going to say 7.07. And there's the egg. And the American version, I do believe it, is the white egg, if I'm not mistaken. Black egg. Duh. I'm staring at a white It has been a long day, y'all. I'm staring at a white egg. It's a black egg on the, the American version. Lord, I don't even know what I'm saying right now. Anyway. um, Okay. <laughs> um, I lost my train of thought. Anyway. um, This is like the hardest pet to take care of in my opinion I like I said mine always dies like day three day four and oh and another thing that scared me too is that I would um I would play with this and you know turn the light off you know at night for it to go to sleep but apparently what it would do is it turn itself back on turn the light back on in the morning and I'm like it's still asleep why is the light on is does that mean like it's the sunrise or something like that is the sun coming up I don't know what that is if you do if you do know what that is let me know but apparently they do that I thought something was wrong with my Tama but it but apparently they just turn the light on by themselves and you can't turn it back off and I don't know why that they do that um also some things about this Tama there is a, a polar bear that attacks. This is what makes it so hard. Um, a polar bear that'll come and try to attack it, kind of like in the garden, the Tamagotchi garden, or the merino. Um, kind of like how the foot the foot comes, like the, the human comes or the frog will come. Uh, this one has the tap sensor to um, make sure that you scare away the predator. Um, also what makes this really hard is that when you play the game, it's two treasure chests and I'll show you what that is. It's two treasure chests and you get like a 50% chance, you know, you have to pick which one the treasure is in. Um, I like the hat game on the, the Merino gotch better personally, but, um, if you know, you can play this and then all of a sudden, um, like an octopus will come out and like 
put ink everywhere and the screen will turn black and you like, you have to start the game over. And I hate that because like if you're in a hurry or you're trying to play this game correctly, you know, and the octopus just comes out and it just makes <laughs> ink everywhere. It just makes it difficult. It just, I don't know. I don't know why this one is so much harder to take care of, but it is a fun, it is a fun Tama. So like I said, comment down below your your experiences with, with this or any other um, virtual pet that you thought was kind of difficult to take care of. I'd like to know. Um, the new Tamas that just came out, the re-releases, a lot of people are having issues with those, especially, um, it, you know, they die like the third day, fourth day, but apparently, um, it's because you feed it too many snacks. If you feed it too many snacks in the toddler stage, maybe, or something, it will die, um, very, very soon. Um, and I read that off Instagram, uh, Rav Tamazone said that on Instagram, um, so I um I believe that a lot of people are struggling with that. So I try not to feed it snacks. I tried to and I forgot to mention that in my last video and I apologize for that. Um but I uh I try not to feed it a lot of snacks. I try to um play the games with it since that's how it loses weight. Anyway, but like I said, it's uh <laughs> it's been a long day and we just got a cold front here in South Texas and it's really super cold. It is. It's like lower uh, or like upper 50s. Um, I don't know what's going on in the in the northern states right now, but it was real. It's really cold, and it just like rained and rained and rained today. And then all of a sudden, it just started getting really cold. And it was 90 yesterday. We were in a pumpkin patch, and it was 90 degrees in the fall. But that's South Texas. That's Gulf Coast. So that's expected but anyway but winter basically came early so we had pho today i like pho pho is really good especially with the hot chili sauce so okay another question has nothing to do with tamagotchis but what is your favorite winter food to eat it could be anything something your family likes or i don't know something from your country or your culture I enjoy many hot foods. I think my favorite winter food is chicken and dumplings. Oh my God, why will this not hatch? Ain't nobody got time for that. <gasps> Thank you. And this is how it hatches. It's so cute. It goes around and you have this tiny little plankton chi. Yum. Okay, and there's the attention icon. And I'm going to just briefly do this because I know y'all read to go. Okay, so there is the meter, the um, like the stats icon. So um, age and weight, one gram. Okay, this, yes, I think you, you have to clean the tank too. You have to clean the water. The water can't be dirty. That's the dirty meter, the skulls. So if the skulls get full, I think it can get sick too. That's another why this is hard. You got to make sure, you got to make sure that you're taking care of it. The clean water. Hungry, happy. Um, I'm not sure what that is. Training, dis discipline maybe? I don't remember. It's been a while since I played. Okay, so this is, f um, food. Oh, excuse me, the food icon. It's a worm, how appropriate. So that's meal, and this one is like a, a dango. I think one of the little things on the stick, the boiled foods. I think that's what that is. Correct me if I'm wrong, I have no idea, but that's what I thought that that is. And then snack, and it's an ice cream and it's so weird how the ice cream is like ginormous I would feed a fish ice cream if I could okay this is the treasure chest game makes my blood pressure go up all right so I'm gonna guess this one oh and it wasn't there surprise one there either you gotta get three out of five I think Oh, I've already lost. Nope. Mm -mm. And not there at all. Imagine that. No treasure. And he's mad. Let's try it again. I'm going to win this game, y'all. And Oh, I kind of hope the octopus comes out so I can show you. Come on. Come on! I can't find any treasure. What is wrong? Okay, there it is. I got to get the next two. Yes. 
All right, one more. Come on, let's do it. Oh, I got two. Okay, we'll come back to that. No. Okay, now, oh, oh, it's probably hungry. Come on, I got time for that. Eat. And I'm going to give it a, some snacks, too. And I'm not winning the game, so we're going to forget that for now. I'll come back to that. That's the toilet. Flush. And I think you can flush it to clean the water, if I'm not mistaken. I don't remember. Okay, that's the, I think, for the polar bear. You, okay, so the polar bear will come, and it'll be, like, on the side of the screen, and you click, and you um, beep on this, or select this icon, and then you tap. And it scares it away. The predator. Okay, that's for when it gets sick. Lights on and off. And then that's attention. I'm going to try this game again. I'm going to win this game. Okay, I found it once. All right, let's see. Two. Let's go. Yes! I told you I was going to win. Am I going to get all five? That would be funny. No. But I got four, and I'm good with that. All right. And I can't get out of it just now. All right. All right. Well, that's him. And there is the clock. And it blinks. It doesn't scroll across real slow like the other Tamagotchis. And this is how you turn the sound off. And that's it. So um, on Instagram, I will put an update. Uh, follow me on Instagram. Uh, I am Tamamama1985. Um, if you liked what you just saw, please like, comment, and subscribe, especially the answers to those questions, those small talk questions. I always like to hear about everybody's different foods and cultures and habits and traditions and all kinds of things because it's fun. It's fun to learn about that. Um, anyway, uh, whatever you are, wherever you're at, whatever you're doing, <laughs> enjoy yourself. Have a great night. Stay warm because I know it's freezing in some places. And I will see you next time. Bye.